Okay, boy, do I have some explaining to do. Um, well, I've had the same memory stick for my camera for like seven months. And this might be the problem. Because I had that same memory stick for like seven months. And, um, I woke up like three weeks ago saying that I need to format a disc. And to do that, I have to delete all my video files from the stick. Which I was not happy about it, but I had to make the ultimate sacrifice to keep on making videos on this memory stick, so we're um you let me get an update on everything. Yeah. My, I know my badges aren't shiny. I didn't really plan on shining them. Um I got seven badges as you can see, they are rusty. When I stopped at like five, I got the mine badge and the snow point city jet and the icicle badge from the snow point and um can wave, you know. There's that. But um we're on the route to Sunny Source City and yeah, I had to delete all my video files and I was not happy about that at all. And then here's my levels. They didn't really change that much. Well, let me actually go through the um, moves and stuff just in case. Level 46 shadow, spooky plate, you know. He went dark, he went dark pulse, I believe, if I can remember. Um, level 46, you know. Hamlet coin. Um, close combat, I think, yeah. And I think, yeah. And there's flame ball, who you just. Just barely, you guys gotta see it evolve. Just barely. Um, I taught it Iron Tail, I think, yeah. Um, and then Heat Rock, level 47. Uh, Ice Beam, I taught it Ice Beam by a TM I found on Route 217, which I never got to cover. I had to make the ultimate sacrifice, I'm sorry. Mystic Water. The camera's getting messed up. Um, and then level 47, um, I think it wave crunch, and, yeah, I think just crunch. And I got rid of synthesis for that. Level 49, mind plate, uh, zen headbutt, I believe. And I taught it earthquake. And I got the TM for it in the, um, in the, what was it, granite cave, I believe. The basement floor of granite cave. And so, thus, you didn't get to see me fight two gym leaders, because those were on my memory stick, which I had to get deleted, which is a real pain. Yeah, I know. It just stinks. Oh. And the, and the music is, volume is down extremely low, because I needed to hear you guys talk. But, um, I also caught the Alga. Azel, Fuchs, and Mr. I can't believe those videos got deleted too. And I was not happy about it. And I need to heal my Pokemon. And you didn't even see me fight those trainers on that route to Sunny Shore City either. And then I finally defeated um, Team Galactic too. Which, you know. You didn't get to see me do that either, which really kind of stinks. I mean, like, why does it have to do this? If you see on my Twitter. Um, I think I'll put the link in the description. You can see all my ma mad tweets about how my camera's broken and all that. Well, it's not. It's just because it's one memory stick. It was all because of that. I wanted, I meant to go to move Pokemon, but well. Uh, here's what's recently in the PC. The Alga. I caught with a Pokeball. I froze it. You should have seen the video. I used, um, I used my, um, Sea Rider. My Gastrodon. And I was really mad. It knows Metal Claw, Ancient Power, Dragon Claw, and Roar of Time. You should have seen the epic battle. But no, I, uh, I'm so mad. Why did the com like the computer couldn't read my memory stick anymore? It's just weird. Maybe because it was so old. Like it's past the life warranty or something. I'm um, attack. You know, I don't even feel like reading these stats because I feel so bad. So, I'm just gonna leave you guys with a brief moment of silence to read its stats. Okay. Now, moving on to Azelf. Yeah. I caught Azelf with an Ultra Ball. You should have seen that 
ep epic battle for that. His ability levitate, and then Gael had the ability pressure, which instead of using one PP per each move you use for each turn, it uses two. And then levitate it gives full imm immunity to ground type moves. Then I'll leave you with a brief moment of silence to read off its stats right here. Okay. Now as confusion up or future sign nasty plot. Nasty plot, watch out for it because if it gets too many of those ups, you could be in deep deep trouble. Future side, you know, it may take three turns to actually hit me. These are actually the explanations in the move of the video. Like this is how I explained its moves um in the video. It's pretty cool. Uproar, you know. If you have a like a Mr. Mime that has the soundproof ability, you'll be all set and you won't get affected by it. And confusion, you know, watch out for it. There's a ten percent of confusing you. Then on to Yuxi, I caught it with an ultra ball. Should have seen the epic battle for that. It took me like eight takes to catch this. It took as of only six, which is totally unfair. Again, the levitate ability, I'll give you a brief moment of silence to read up its moves. Your stats again. Okay. Confusion, yawn, future side, and amnesia. Amnesia raises up its special attack, special defense and defense, I believe, sharply. Um, let me actually look that up just to make sure. Hey, where is that? It's so hard to see the um, red marker thing. Um. It's attacked with hunk psychic energy. Oh wait, hold on. Two turns. Oh yeah, Sarpley was special defense. Yeah, only special defense. Yawn can put you to sleep after you use about two turns on it. Um, confusion, watch out for it. In future side again, it may take two turns to actually hit you. Now on to Misprit. Misprit, unlike Yuxin Azelf, it actually doesn't stay in its carbon, so you have to go chase after it. Um, I kept main look on shadow just because this occasion i caught with an ultra ball you should have seen the epic battle i wish i could also show you the um the um outtakes for that but um i got again got deleted from them mr quitch i'm really angry from that its speed range is between 90 and 100 i'm using my finger um of what i can remember I, i'm not exactly sure i haven't looked it up again as what i already said that i think it had the levitate ability yeah I think I already said that though. 90 and 100 range of speed. So yeah, but my shadow is fast enough for it anyway. If you have like a Gengar that's a little slow and under leveled, because I'm like over leveled, um, or a Hanchko that knows me look or something like that, uh, equip the Quick Claw to it. You could get lucky, you know, you never know. Confusion, Lucky Chant, Future Sign, Charm. Charm lowers your attack harshly, which was irritating, but. I already weakened it enough to where I could actually just throw the Pokeballs anyway. Future Shot may take 3 turns to actually hit me. Lucky Chant blocks critical hits for about 3 turns I believe. Box it from getting critical hits on it, which is a, which was really good because I didn't really want to get a critical hit on this thing. And then Confusion, yeah it, led, it left me with like 20 HP, like down to deep deep red health every time it used it. So I had to pray not to get a Confusion and Future Shot combo. Because it could use confusion and then I get, could get I could get hit by the future side attack. You know, that was a little irritating. But you didn't get to see me catch any of these. And I'm really mad. But I'll explain the outtakes on Miss Brit. They were just like, I forgot to use Mean Look, you know, first. Because you have to use Mean Look first. Um, and then the other one was, I actually got a critical hit on it. You know, or it fainted me. Yeah, I think it was the one where I actually got a critical hit on. Okay. I'm still gonna leave the um, volume down for the whole video. I just chewed you off, you, you off for almost 10 minutes now. I'm looking for the mark map on my Poketch. Okay, when you're catching Misbit, this is a good app to use. In fact, it's. I went in the Pokemon Center. Okay, 
The shapes didn't actually go back to its normal place after I used it. Well, here where you would be, you would be like right here since you would go to Lake Verity. And then it would go, it, it appears as a little cat sign anywhere on the map. So yeah. And then you'd have to go chase that. The trick is once you switch routes, it will. So you want to put a repellent once you're in the same area as it, like in the same route. I use Jude Life City because that's a good place to switch routes. So, yeah, I'm sorry guys, but this is an update video, and I'm running into the time limit, so we just gotta continue on to Sunny Soul City. I didn't fight the fishermen there, so that's what we're gonna do next, and then head off to Sunny Soul City.